The three-day course that took place at the Patrick Iyambo Police College in Vintu came to an end today with the participants writing exams about what they have learned. The course, which was divided in both theory and practice, was attended mostly by former and current players. According to the course facilitator Valid Abdels Ahmad, participants were given pointers as per the rules of the game, as well as tools on how to handle conflicts within a match. They were also taught the technical aspects of how to apply the rules. In the past 10 years, no referee courses were offered to aspiring referees and Abdels Ahmad hopes that this course will kickstart the process for more training sessions to follow in future. He told NBC Sport that it's no use for the federation to support teams and coaches if there are no referees. He hopes that after this course, things will be different. 56 participants. I want to inform you that the maximum number is 25. We have, we have 36. All of them did very well in theoretical and practical. Uh, but it is not enough. It is just the first step and the second step will be in the uh, Federation's side to nominate them for uh, the national matches to uh, support them. The course participants were all happy with the information they gathered and said they can't wait to go back and implement the knowledge they gained. It's not really as easy as being a player and knowing the rules, but being a referee means you need all characteristics, how to be fair, you need to know the rules of, of the game and you need to know how to handle technicalities throughout the game. What the, the course has done for me is exposure, number one, exposure, uh, information. I'm a young player and I've not had a lot of experience with playing in general and when it comes to volleyball, the rules of volleyball. Abdel Samad's advice to the Namibian Volleyball Federation is to give the participants more training altogether and expose them on the international level where they will share knowledge with other Zone 6 members for their own benefit.